Um, don't worry, yeah? You'll be well very soon, yeah? My darling son. Yeah? What will I do without you? Nah, hmm. nothing. <laughs> I love you. Hmm. Ah. Um, you, you'll be late for work, oh. Won't your boss be angry? Angry? And let him be angry now. If you are happy, that is enough for me. Where is that woman you call your wife? Naomi. Mm. She's sleeping. She's very tired. <laughs> tired? What made her tired? She said she ate overfeeding last night. You know, when I asked her this morning. But she's supposed to be the one here feeding me. She knows I'm not feeling fine. So that you can go off to work. Mommy, I'm not complaining now. Mm. Mm. Oh, son, you don't have to complain. This is what she has to do because she is a wife. These were the attitudes your father exhibited that made me leave him. And I moved out of that house and I broke the marriage. Now your wife wants to do the same thing to you. So she will eventually break your heart. She's supposed to be the one sitting here. Why you go off to work to provide food and money for this house? She has wifed you to submission. And you are sitting down, you are looking at her. I want you to stand up. Put your foot down as a man. Act like a man and tell her something, no? Do you know this thing you are saying is very true? Oh. I mean, it's, it's as if I've been blind oh. all this while. Baby, I still around. Yes, I, I thought you've left though. No, I'm, I'm feeding my mommy. Yeah. Oh. Um, um, just wait, wait. Do you know that you are the most insensitive wife the world has ever seen? Hmm? You know my mom is not feeling fine and you can't come out to take care of her. But that is what you are doing now. Mm? And I was tired. You know I ate overfeeding last night. Can you hear yourself? You ate overfeeding last night. So, when did overfeeding become work? Mm. Eh? Look, I am the man of this household. So because you ate overfeeding, you are tired. Mm. I mean, God has blessed me. I'm a clerk in the Ministry of Justice. Mm. I go to work. I provide money for food. Mm. I stock the house for you. And now you want me to even do your own job on top of all that. Eh? Okay, my love, I'm sorry. Let me do the feeding. Uh, hey, that's better. Uh, mommy, don't worry, you'll be fine, you yeah? Give me a call, you yeah? Mm -hmm. I love you, yeah? I love you too, okay. my baby. I'm going to work now. Uh -huh. yeah? ah, would you kiss me bye bye too? <laughs> okay. Go well, my Move near me now. You want you to pour me, ah? Mama, no do my car is fast. Please slowly. Okay, ma, sorry. Come mm. wait. Are you really doing this from your heart? I am doing it from my mind. Do you have any problem with that? I don't. But even if you do it with your whole body and your soul, I won't be moved. Hmm. I was just um, I was smiling and wondering in my mind how the mighty are falling. Meaning? One moment you are boxing the air and threatening to beat your son's wife black and blue. Only suddenly and gradually do you realize that you are weak. And the beautiful lady you are threatening to beat is keeping you alive by feeding you. <laughs> you can have all the fun you want. But I promise you, you will have from me when I get well. Mama, I can't wait to. I cannot wait at all for now. Every day be threatening me that you want to beat me. I'm ready for you now. Fall out, Mama. Fall out. I'm ready for you today. Let's see if we win today. Fall out. Hey. Hey, you want to fight with me because you know I'm not feeling fine. Hmm, but Naomi, if you annoy me more than this, eh, I will get up here and beat you with my last power, just like Samson. Eh, hey, so that they will say it's me that killed you, Abby. Sorry, oh. Ah. 
How is my mommy doing? My mommy is fine, thank you. Good to help you. Oh, I'm supposed to be fine, but for the fact that you say you're not fine, I'm not fine. <laughs> That's very touching. I feel young again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mommy, see, what is for you? Oh, you know exactly what I want. Yeah. Yes, and <laughs> Thank you. What are all these? And who did you buy them for? Eh? What? This? No, that. What else should I be asking about? Uh, I bought it for my mommy. Uh, is this what they buy for sick people? When I was sick, what did you buy for me? When you were sick, I had no money. Oh, so you were ready for me to die, Abby? You could not borrow money to help me stay alive. Why are you talking like this? Even as my mommy saw this thing, she said that she's already getting better. Hey, I have never seen where a sick person would eat all this type of thing. Ah, when I'm sick, I eat cake and meat pie. Besides, since afternoon, I've been feeling feverish and I've not been able to eat anything. But when I saw this, my appetite came alive. Guti, even your dead body can eat, so stay out of this. I'm trying to handle a big family problem here. Eee! Baby, did you hear that my baby? She called me a problem. This was what your father did to me many years ago. That made me leave him. Now your wife wants to do the same thing to you. She wants to destroy you so that she can remarry. Put your food down and tell her you are the man of this house. Tell her something, no? Guti, yeah. uh, please feed my mommy. Oh, I will. It's my mommy. I want to see you inside now. <coughs> Good thing. Uh, madam. You know I'm not feeling fine. And I need this food to recover. Mm. Uh, well, I thought you would not be able to finish it, so I decided just to help you. And besides, you know, I'm feeling feverish too. Go uh, to your house and help yourself to some drugs. No, the only drugs in this life is food. Don't right? get well on my food. I have to feed myself too. Okay, okay. I'm <coughs> sorry. I, I, I won't do that again. It's not fair. I'm supposed to be your wife. But you are my wife. Then why are you treating me like a maid? Eh? Is it because I'm managing you? Or don't you know how hot my market is outside? Listen, listen. I don't care how hot your market is outside. Just don't quarrel with my mommy. Who is quarreling with your mommy? I'm quarreling with you. Uh, because I bought snacks for her when she's not well and I didn't buy for you when you were sick. And when I'm well too. Okay. I'll start buying now. Mm, no. Start now. I want five meat pies and five sausages. Did you just hear yourself? I said it. I didn't have to hear it. Okay, I don't have money. Hey! Oh, oh, oh. It's when it's my own turn now that you don't have money, Abby. Okay, assume I am sick and act. Let me see if you watch me die. I'm sorry to let you down, but I'm not buying anything. Eh? You will buy it, oh? I will not. You will buy it. I will not. I said you will buy it. I said I will not. I said you will buy it. I will not. But you will buy it. I will not. Mm. You will buy it. Yes, I'll buy it. Good. Ah, uh, what happened? I, Mama is getting better. I know, but what happened to the snacks? Uh, you can guess. <laughs> Guti, I bought these things for my family! But I told you I was feeling feverish too. But you are not my family, you are my friend! Okay, so, sorry, I can replace it now. Fine, replace it! Money. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. Hey, baby, mommy wants some more snacks too. Please. Please be quick, be of quick! Of course, I will. Mommy, the doctor will be here soon. Thank you. How are you feeling? Um, I'm feeling very strange. Ah, too many people in this room. It's making me sicker. I think I could do it one person at a time. You are stylishly asking me out of the living room of my family. I will not take that. But baby, can you hear that? She, she, she wants to kill me. She wants to send me to an early grave. Tell her something, no? It's okay, it's okay. Uh, baby, you ordered for snacks and I'm getting you the snacks. Can't you just do this one for me? Let her leave.
Uh, from the look of things, you just need a lot of rest. It is the way you think. And rest, relax yourself more. You can give me a call if any changes occur, which I doubt there will be any. However, by tomorrow, if you're not yet better, I'll be left with no other option than to admit you in my clinic. Praise the Lord! Okay, guys, I'll have to take my leave now. Okay. Thank you for coming, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you. Yeah, you. Uh, welcome. We'll expect you tomorrow. Yeah, you take care tomorrow. Yeah, we will. Bye bye. <coughs> Ah, good to you, are back. I didn't get to buy it from where you sent me. And since I'm not sure of their ways, I... I just... You what? You mean you tasted from all of them? No, 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 I just want to be sure if they are good. Who sent you? So you opened everything and used your hand to touch them. This is what all of us are supposed to eat. You don't know you would have contaminated it with gems. Okay, okay, I, I better Coco put everything together and... No. Why, Mr. Biggs, you went to another place? Imagine. Bam, 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 cockadu, cockadu, do. Yo, 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 yo. There is a village. I took up my mountain. Yeah, the master best do love. So pass on me red so do me red do me red so ooh ah 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 did you hear when the doctor said I need close supervision? He was referring to the hospital tomorrow. What I need tomorrow, I can use today. And who better can give it to me anyway than my one and only son? Provisious. <laughs> Darling, you're not saying anything. So how is she feeling now? Is she well enough to return to her room or are you going to take her to the hospital? Well, uh, from what I can see. Uh, Bobby, you know me. Please go and help me check in my room for something. If you don't find it, check in your room. I'm not going anywhere. I want to hear what the doctor has to say. Uh, wait now. Mommy, what is it? A um, hundred thousand naira. Hundred thousand naira? Doctor, you have to help me. Tell them that I need closer supervision and that I am not fit enough to sleep alone yet. But you look and feel very strong enough. Just do it! Why? I'll give you a simple reason. Their room is air conditioned and mine is not. I could still do it a few days there. Are you happy now? I'm sorry, madam. 
it is against my profession to tell lies about the state of a patient's health. But you are sworn to secrecy about your patient's health. Not in cases like this. I mean, you're fine and I can speak out. How much are you asking for? I'm not asking for anything. But you have to help me now. The best I can do to help you now is to take my leave. Mommy, we've checked everywhere. We didn't see it all. Think well, Mama. Where did you drop it? Drop what? The money now. The hundred thousand naira. Oh, that. Um, it was when you entered the room that I remember that um, it was in my dream. Um, I'm sorry. Sorry. Oh, not again. Papi, tell your mommy to go to her room, oh. oh but I'm not well now. Oh. You are well. She's just pretending. But you see your wife insulting me. Oh, because I'm asking for some tender loving care. Do you ask me to go? No, you can stay. Uh -huh. Stay, okay? Uh -huh. Sweetheart, ask her to leave. Mommy, leave. Oh, Bobby, so you walk me out of this room. Ask me to stay now. Sweetheart, ask her to leave. Mommy, leave. Just leave. Eh? Mommy, you remember what your daddy did to me? You remember what he did to me? Okay, stay. You can stay. Okay? Hmm. Sweetheart, ask her to leave. Mommy, leave. Ask me to stay. Mommy, stay. Ask her to leave. Mommy, leave. Ask me to stay, John. Stay. Ask her to leave. Mommy, leave. Ask me to stay, John. Mommy, stay. Ask her to leave. Leave. Ask me to stay. Stay. Ask her to leave. Leave. Ask me to stay. Ask her to leave. Stay. Leave. Stay. Leave me. Leave me. Leave me. Leave me. You push. Leave me. Ah. You're not going anywhere. You're cursing. No. You must not stay in this room. You can't stay in this room. I'm not well, no. Wife, we get. I have never heard of this kind of thing in my life. Hmm? You are not only trying to break your son's home, you also want to break his bed. <laughs> you have been insulting me since. And I haven't been answering you just because you know I'm not well. Mama? Well or no well? Eh? If you annoy me, I will pin you down. In fact, I will so deal with you that even Bobby will not be able to do anything about it. So. You want to beat me now, Abby? In fact, what I will do to you, eh? When I start dealing with you, say, who do you want to do? Mama, leave my hand, though. Who do you want to do? With? Mm. Is it me you're talking to? Mm -mm. When next you want to try, Mama, mm. you will check your mind to remember that she can do you some mm. evil harm. I give you one hand. Just one hand. How mm. dare you? Now shake your head and be saying you're sorry. Mm -hmm. I'll be waving your hand like that. You're talking to me, you're pointing at me. I'm just enough for your village. 